happy International Women's Day and a big congratulations to ASEAN, UN Women and USAID for launching the ASEAN Regional Study on Women, Peace and Security at this very special day. International Women's Day celebrates generations of women pioneers who dare to make a difference, breaking unbreakable barriers to create greater equality and dignity for women everywhere. The Women, Peace and Security Agenda is a victory for women's leadership and mobilization, bringing about a deep transformation in the peace and security sector, a traditional male bastion. There are just three simple messages in the WPS agenda. First, that inclusive peace is lasting peace. Second, the need to have meaningful women's participation and leadership, not just for women's human rights consideration, but in order to build a solid economic, social, and political foundations for a just and fair societies everywhere. And thirdly, that we have to stress the importance of women's roles as peacekeepers, peacemakers, decision makers, crisis responders, as well as the importance of empowering women and girls as an integral part of any efforts to maintain international peace and security. It is so timely that we are launching this report at this particular time, when ASEAN is advancing its momentum to deal with the new and persistent challenges that is related to the changing peace and security landscape. And the importance of making sure that the WPS agenda is integral to that effort, be it from pandemic response to ending violent extremisms, trafficking in persons, to the need to strengthen democratic governance and democratic values at this particular time. The recommendations in the studies are extremely important and need to be taken into consideration as we move forward on the WPS agenda, as well as to strengthen the security, sustainable development, and human rights nexus as ASEAN move forward towards a people-centered community. I congratulate everyone, and I would like to express my deep solidarity as we continue on this journey together.